Hey everybody, so here's uh, the foundry setup completed, ready to test my atomizer burner. Uh, as you can see I'm using pure diesel fuel right here, actually it does have a little bit of waste oil in it, but that was just because the container had a little bit in there when I filled it with diesel. Um, I do have a couple people that want to give me waste oil through Craigslist, so I might follow them up later, but uh, I'll be testing with just diesel today. As you can see it has a consistency of just about water, so I should be getting the same uh, gallon per hour flow rate. Also one thing I haven't measured is the head pressure um, of the fuel and so from about the atomizer I'm getting looks like 33 inches of, uh, of uh, head pressure so that'll work pretty well. Got the power strip over here with the compressor of course, ignition source. I'm going to use this ball of uh, newspaper soaked in diesel fuel to light it off. Uh, of course the burner right here blower controls all ready to go. The uh, little improvised airline holder because it popped off last night during trials. Uh, but okay, or trials with water. Anyway, um, yeah, and the compressor gets really hot after running about 30 minutes, so this test shouldn't be too long. Uh, the bore of the furnace, I'm going to leave my old crucible in there. It's really oxidized stuff because I used it with uh, potassium chloride and it's just been sitting in the garage forever. So I'm just going to use that in there to see how hot it is. And of course my new furnace lid, which has been lined with kale wool that I found. And so, I mean, it's it's super light. It used to be made of this refractory, so, I mean, it used to be probably 20 pounds. Now I can lift it with one hand by one tab, so that'll be a welcome relief. Okay, I mean, got my tripod right here. Just mount the camera, and then uh, I'll narrate as I get it going, and I'll put the camera as close as I dare. Um, yeah, okay, the first step is going to be priming the fuel line. Actually, I'll show that up close. Uh, here's the fuel line. Prime the line, and you can see it shooting into the furnace down there. Alright, it's ready to go. Test the blower. Um, we'll spin. Oh, I gotta turn this on. Oh, we can test the atomization too. I'm turning on the, the switch that turns on the compressor. See that? That's what I call atomization. Nothing in there is hot. That's just compressed air atomizing diesel fuel. Alright. Compressor off because it only has a certain duty cycle and I want to get the maximum out of it. I'm going to light the piece of newspaper. I'm going to drop it into the furnace. And then I'm going to uh, activate the compressor and then the fuel. And then we'll see what happens. Hopefully it won't be too smoky. Most of my neighbors are probably still at work, but... Some of them like to be pains in the ass, and <laughs> if the fire department comes, this will make a great video. <laughs> okay, here we go. One diesel soap newspaper wad. Okay. Come on. I think it's sparking. Yeah. You gotta be joking. Oh, there we are. One diesel soaked wad of newspaper. Compressor's on. I think it works. My life for a working lighter. 
All right, I'll be back when I get a lighter that works. Oh shit, it's starting to rain. Hang on, go be a 